this journey so far has been everything I've dreamed of. And I feel like I've imagined this for a while, um, this kind of relationship with brothers and strangers being possible, being able to heal some of my, um, my trauma and wounds from my childhood with my blood brothers, um, coming together with these men that were strangers beforehand. It's already something that's changed my life and I can see the trajectory of it um, affecting so many things in my life from here on out. Yeah, I feel honored to be here with these men and um, to hear their stories, to um, share so many similarities and know that we're not alone and to understand each other on a deep level and to have that willingness to want to be attentive and understand each other is something sometimes us men can't find in the outside world. But coming here to nature and um, breaking it down to a primitive level of uh, our feelings and our instincts and our inner guidance and the, the, the inner child in us that is trying to speak to us the man that is trying to understand himself as a as a grown man now and try to find his place in this world um, is something that I've come to finally understand after years of searching hard and what found what felt like strenuous years of pain and suffering hard on my behalf of not understanding myself I can't necessarily blame that on the world didn't understand myself, so I placed myself in situations where they weren't healthy for me. I think it's very important that I take from this journey that I don't have to continue the trauma cycles I have. Um, I don't continue to have to continue to live in fear of um, rejection from other men. I don't have to hold on to the feeling of rejection from people in this real period. I know who I am now. I know what my purpose is now. Walking into the hike, it was our decision from the beginning of picking our backpacks up and go, do we want to ha hike the extra mile out of five mile hike that we already had to go through? We're like, fuck it, let's tag one more mile on. Let's go the extra mile. Let's see where that goes. It got us warmed up, it got us acclimated. We got to know each other very well in the course over the hike, sharing with each other, switching groups of two so we could share why we're here, what we plan to get out of it. I tried to not have too many expectations of what was going to happen. I just knew in my soul that it was something I truly desired and needed. And I'm beyond grateful for these strangers and they're now brothers. I feel like that. We want to be lifelong friends. We want to do a lot of traveling and a lot of great things and stay in contact with each other and check up on each other and really ask, how are you doing? What are you up to? Most importantly to me is, would I bring back from this? Would I bring home from this experience? And that is uh, being more intensive to my brothers, um, blood or not, being more attentive and understanding towards my mother, the mother of my daughter, my daughter, um, being there for them with a full cup and knowing I have to keep my cup, cup full myself. Um, and that is absolutely my choice where I pour my cup. And that it's not in my best interest to empty my cup out for everybody else and leave nothing less nothing left for myself. So that's what I take from this experience is that I can't help others unless I help myself first. Some of these exercises really broken into deep part of my spirit and soul that I felt was dead or, or just not alive completely. Um, I felt kind of like a zombie for a while and now I feel like that true love for humanity as a whole is here now and I can embrace that within and around me. I feel I feel it a connection that sparked this weekend that is going to ripple out into this world because of the work that we did here. Because of the vulnerable sharing of our stories 
that we've been here change our lives. I truly wish more men would experience things like this, but no one can tell you to do that. You've, you've got to want that. You've got to really want that. But what I will tell you from my experience, so worth it. And if you want it, go get it. Don't wait for it. The timing won't be divine and right for you, but you've got to really want it. And I've wanted this relationship with brothers for a very long time, and it's it's here. And I feel like a changed man. But I'm going to carry this into this world. Never forget this weekend, these four days, and this journey with these 11 men and myself. Thank you forever for sharing your stories with me and the reflections that we come upon throughout this journey. I'm forever grateful. I'm blessed to be to be here to share this experience. Um, yeah, I love you all. This world uh, needs more things like this. I hope you find peace. I hope you find you, and I hope you know the peace lies within you. You are loved. Namaste.